hope your plans are already made to attend the 2013 International Production and Processing Expo, comprised of the three co-located trade shows, the International Poultry Expo, International Feed Expo, and AMI's International Meat Expo. It will be held Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, January 29th, 30th, and 31st in Atlanta. And IPPE Week, January 28th through February 1st, will feature educational opportunities throughout the week. 2013 will also mark IPE's 65th year of continuous service to the poultry industry in Atlanta. The International Production and Processing Expo will feature the huge exhibit floor, a variety of education programs, company and organization meetings, and many other informative and exciting activities to make it the most important week of the year. More than 25,000 industry leaders from more than 100 countries are expected to travel to Atlanta for the world's most extensive learning and networking opportunities for poultry, feed, and meat industry management. The International Production and Processing Expo is the world's largest exhibition of the latest technology, equipment, and services for meat, poultry, and egg production, processing and packaging, and feed manufacturing. Connecting the farm to table, all segments of the industry are represented. Live production, hatcheries, processing, further processing, marketing, feed milling, rendering, and all support activities. Over 1,000 exhibiting companies in over 400,000 net square feet of exhibit space will display their latest technology and services. And many exhibitors will introduce new products that will be shown for the first time at the expo. Complementing the exhibit floor, a comprehensive schedule of education programs will keep poultry, feed, and meat management current on the important concerns facing the industries today. In 2013, the education sessions will begin on Monday and continue through Friday. Speakers will include prominent industry leaders, technical specialists, and researchers addressing cutting-edge issues that impact production and processing operations, environmental management, sustainability, food safety, economic trends, and global markets. As an example, the 2012 Expo featured many top-level speakers, such as Purdue Farms Chairman Jim Purdue and Mike Helgeson, CEO of GMP Company, USDA Undersecretary for Food Safety, Dr. Elizabeth Hagen, and Georgia Governor Nathan Deal. The International Production and Processing Expo is truly international, and we welcome our friends from around the world. The 2012 Expo attracted more than 4,100 visitors from over 100 countries. An international business center will be available. In addition, the U.S. Department of Commerce offers the International Buyer Program to connect international guests with U.S. suppliers. In 2013, a reception will be held on the show floor on Tuesday and will be followed on Wednesday with an international networking reception at the Georgia Aquarium the largest aquarium in the world. The show offers a variety of services and amenities. Featherfest activities are planned during the week to engage attendees in fun events at the expo. Kiosks will assist you in locating exhibitors with particular products or services. And Wi-Fi is available throughout the exhibit halls for you to stay connected. Complimentary shuttle bus service provides transportation between the Georgia World Congress Center and major hotels. And shuttle bus service will be available from the convention center to the Atlanta airport following the close of the show on Thursday. We look forward to welcoming you to Atlanta and the 2013 International Production and Processing Expo, comprised of the three co-located trade shows, the International Poultry Expo, International Feed Expo, and AMI's International Meat Expo. IPPE will be the place to be in January, and we will see you there.